An EV war has supercharged Karnataka politics with Ola gearing up for an EV hub in Tamil Nadu. Industrialists and opposition members in Karnataka are asking why did the election bound state lose out on this mega investment. Karnataka's loss is Tamil Nadu's big gain. Ola Electric has signed a memorandum of understanding with the Tamil Nadu government to set up an auto plant picking the state over Karnataka. According to the MOU, the electric vehicle plant planned by Ola will be the world's largest. Ola is likely to invest 7,614 crore rupees in the project. The plant will manufacture battery cells, two wheelers and four wheelers. The whole project will be spread across 2,000 acres in Tamil Nadu. The investment is expected to generate more than 3,000 direct jobs. The Ola deal with Tamil Nadu government has sparked a political showdown in Karnataka. The opposition is asking the Basavaraj Bombay government why Karnataka, from where Ola started its journey, failed to back the deal. The Congress is accusing the BJP government in the state of policy paralysis. It's a big loss. A lot of companies are going from Karnataka to Tamil Nadu to Telangana because this government has totally failed. 40% commission government. They have to pay money for the government. They have to pay money for the ministers. They have to pay for the officers. So that's what we have been telling this government is total of corruption. So people are moving around from Karnataka. The opposition lashed out at the BJP for its focus on Hindutva instead of development. We are losing thousands of jobs, crores of uh, investments, and who is responsible for this? So what kind of uh, investment environment is the current government giving? It goes to show that they are more interested in their 40 percent rather than the people's, uh, rather than the, uh, investments coming into Karnataka, uh, Karnataka and creating jobs for the people of Karnataka. For the BJP, already under pressure over corruption charges, the loss of a big ticket investment ahead of elections this year is an embarrassment. Congress, government, Congress, people are murmuring only corruption, corruption, corruption. Mm -hmm. They are not ready 